on the first day of Vlogmas, Whitney and Tina did single swag. Yay! <laughs> You'd think she doesn't sing ever, but the fact is she was in choir and she sings often in the car. So Whitney. It's crazy. <laughs> Tell them lies. Yeah, I'm a liar. You guys, welcome back to the vlog and now it's Vlogmas! Here we are. As you can tell, we are wearing matching outfits. It's a favorite thing of me for us to do. It's Tina's favorite, yeah. And it's fun to do when you have friends you can match with or siblings you can match with. It is fun. It's a little chilly though, so we do have a blanket, even though we have some matching shorts on. It's I'm sure you'll see a picture. Oh, I'll, I'll post one. One, two, three. Insert here. All right, first things first, I got Whitney a little gift for her to open before. We do the single swag. From Shutterfly. Yeah. Drum roll, please. So the photo of you. <laughs> That's right. Aww. It's where we were last year. And on the back it says... Traveling raindrops. That's our vlog. Look at us, guys. I made her an ornament. I have the matching one already on my tree. <laughs> I put it up top on the back so she wouldn't notice it when she came over. So cute. And now I can move it to the front. <laughs> I'll put it on my favorite things tree. Yay. Thank you. Look at us in matching outfits again. Yeah. Oh, there's a little ribbon that goes in it that's inside there. I didn't want to do it for you know how long with the ribbon to be. Oh. I think I made mine pretty long oh, so I it would like hang. Yeah. Yes. But yeah. Very cute. I've done a lot of Shutterfly gifts over the years. That's one of the things I like doing is ornaments. I got one for Sam last year of Aurora. Who's Rory? <laughs> Her child. Well, thank you. You're welcome. So cute. I'll post a fit. Uh, well, so it's not just like, like your a... Christmas gift because it's for Christmas, but we'll tag it. We'll put a picture in it with the vlog. Yeah, we'll add it. All right. So now let's get on to single, single swag. Now we. Go ahead. So I did want to announce the winner of our last oh, yes. giveaway. We said that if you gave us an idea for Vlogmas that you would be entered in a giveaway. And the winner is... Justine! You um, won! Seattle, Washington. <laughs> so Justine, we will be contacting you soon on how you're going to receive your special treasure. <laughs> what a treasure. It is a treasure. Open! We ready? <laughs> All right, Whitney, go ahead and pull out something fun for us to look at. Okay, Ooh. let's see. So the first thing on my in my box is a pair of socks. Now let's see. Looks like they have little grippies on them. We love a good grippy. I made sure. Tabby Noor socks. Keep your feet coiz co coizy. Coizy. <laughs> cozy and comfortable. Coizy. At home or on the go with these stylish, long-lasting socks. Produced with certified organic combed cotton for sixteen dollars. So there you go. We'll try them out. I'm not the hugest sock fan, but uh, she gets warm easy. I do uh, work in a basement currently, so we'll try them out. Yes. So again, when you guys do single swag, you get a little card that says each item how much it costs and gives a little description. So um, well, I got myself some. Pamper You Relaxing Lavender Body Lotion. Again, a scent Whitney just loves. I do box. love, <coughs> sorry, lavender. So this is by We Live Like This. So it is a $12 lotion. Very nice. Vegan and cruelty free. Yeah, no oh, animals were harmed. I'm going to sell it really fast. It's sealed, so JK. <laughs> But I do, I use a lot of lotion because I have lots of tattoos, so that's very helpful. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Whitney? Okay. Let's see here. Um, mm -hmm. Replenishing Cucumber Mist. God, do you guys remember the 90s when cucumber was the smell for Bath & Body Works? Yeah. The lotion, the soap, the, um, it had little beads in it too. Remember the soap had those beads? Yeah. For exfoliation, I think is what it was. Yeah. Cucumber melon, right? Memories. An invigorating mist formulated with an infusion of nutrient-rich botanicals and cucumber essential water. The cucumber skin will be left feeling refreshed water. and revitalized. And it retails for $20. Oh. It's 
Um, I can't open it. Give it a nice smell. This is what we have the same of. That's exciting for us. What a strange one. Mm, you have glasses. <laughs> Saved by the glasses. What if it, like, you react? Careful. What am I going to react to? Remember we did a face mask and you reacted badly to that? Just because it was on too long. It's cucumber and water, Tina. It's not going to do anything. Okay. She's going to have an allergic reaction to the cucumber. We're like, no! It does smell nice. I mean, it feels like anything else she's wearing in her face. No? Okay. Nothing exciting. So I assume we have the same one. We want to go for that one. What do we have the same one? Oh. It looks like a little wallet insert, perhaps, from Sienna. Blankety, uh, Blakely? Blakely wallet with detachable wrist strap. Oh. Interesting. It is a $38 product. And a nice, I want to say salmon color. I mean, perfect for Washington. <laughs> So, now see like this is the kind of thing I would put in my apron at work. Like, yeah, I could see you using this a lot. It's okay for me, yes. So like your ID goes in there and it has a little place for other cards and yeah. a small little pocket. Yeah. Not bad. No. Oh, I don't know why it's $38. Let's see on the map. I just like this one you can get for like 12 at <laughs> Target. But yeah. So this I will probably end up using like this week at work. There you go. Yeah. Very Something nice. useful. All right. Go ahead, Whit. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, pomegranate scented bath bombs. Pomegranate is a nice scent. Smell. Nice. Mm, yeah. Um. Bye. I don't know. Oh, here there. Goddess Sea Minerals Pomegranate Scented Bath Bombs for eighteen dollars. Turn your bath time into the mini retreat you deserve with this little bundle of joy. Mini retreat is right. I will. Like some nice candles, smell like pomegranate, you know. There you go. All right. So, I've got to do the same treat again this time. Oh, probably. I have a, oh, I've already had one of these before. The Belgian Boys Cocoa Stoop Waffle. Stoop Waffle? So, so this supposed to be put on top of like tea or something. Oh. It's what I've been told how to eat them. My friend Erin suggested it to me. She said put it on top of like cocoa so it moistens it and heats it up a little bit. Everyone loves a good moisture. Like on top cookie. of your cup, not like in it, you know. So yeah. Try is... dipping your waffles in fresh milk. A whole different thing than what I was told. Well, do we trust Aaron or do we trust the Belgian boys? I probably will do one of like try each way. So this is falling out. I'm very cold. So these are for four dollars. Mm -hmm. No GMO, no corn syrup containing non-artificial colors, flavors, and preservatives. But uh, sorry, Jamie, it doesn't say gluten-free, so stay no. away. Stay away. Stay away. Stay away. I think we have the same thing for both these items. Oh, okay. What one do you want to do first? Anything else that you don't have? No. I have this. I think. I'll go for it then. This is a glow primer base illuminator. Um, a non-sticky revitalizing primer that gives your skin a subtle glow while helping you look fabulously wide awake. Perfect for teachers. So what it says? No. Oh. <laughs> I was like, wow! They pegged her good! You guys, she's a teacher! <laughs> We're gonna go single swim! <laughs> Sorry, that really had me going. Uh, retails for eighteen dollars. Vegan, no gluten, Jamie. Woo! Uh, no mineral oil, no parabens. With peach kernel oil and orange fruit extract. Citrusy. I can't smell it. 
It's all. It's all, all, all wrapped up. It's sick, safely secured. No oxygen got to that thing. No. It's pandemic proof. Yes. There's no smell to this. Well, that's good though. It's just made from those products, right? Well, Too Faced has some smells to it. There you go. Does my hand look uh, glowy? Refreshed. Refreshed? It does. Youthful. <laughs> Youthful. <laughs> okay. So we have this is Gemma Simone Aqua Beaded something. Necklace. Ooh. With a pop. Oh, it has to pop the color. Oh, that's cute. We have this little piece of jewelry. It's a necklace. I like the little circle. How much does that retail for? $64. They sent us those expensive jewelry. <laughs> Two ra layers of rose gold chains with a pendant and aqua bead accents. Yeah. That's nice. So I just bought a few dresses from Tor that have some aqua in it. So that's a little nice with it. Thank you, single swag. They knew. They knew. They, they followed what I bought. Probably. Like these dresses. She bought boots. <laughs> she's, she's ready to go out. Oh, yes. There you go. Beautiful. Probably cannot see. Maybe a little bit. Well, they'll see it when I pair it with a dress for New Year's Eve. This is not a I'm staying in, but oh, and the last thing we got is a calendar. Oh well, the most useless thing for right now. What is it? Hold on. Oh yeah, it's a Molly Jacobs 2001 planner calendar for $24. Dream big, be grateful, laugh a lot, and love yourself, which are all very good things that we should be doing every day anyway. Look, my goal for 2020 was to love myself, remember? I do remember. My goal for 2021 is still maintaining that. Oh, okay. It's a good goal. Yeah. Notes. Oh, it's just a bunch of notes. Why is this so expensive? No, it's a calendar. It's a planner. Well, all I see is all these notes back here. When each month has a note section. My birthday is on a Friday this year, and Whitney's is on a Tuesday. Try to figure that out. Well, well, um, I gotta say, I probably won't use this shit. I'll leave Sorry, it. I'll take that out. I'll leave it on my like. I probably won't use it. I'll leave it beside my laptop, and I'll take a peek at it. And I'll probably go, oh yeah, use it. And I won't. I'll maintain putting things in my phone. <laughs> well, I mean, to be honest, we're still uh, in lockdown. In here. lockdown. And uh, who knows when it's going to lift? Who knows when it's going to lift? You know, Tina and I stay pretty well quarantined so we can still see each other. But uh, no. who knows when you can actually make plans to use anything right like that with. So. Well, I have to say, I was really hoping for more like Christmassy, a holiday theme, holiday theme box. box. So I'm a little disappointed. Yeah. Although, like, it's nice products, but you think they would have marketed towards December? Yeah. Well, we do have. Um, like, I don't have any. I'm um, no. I don't have an Ipsy coming this month, but she has Ipsy coming this month. You can tell me if yours is purchasing or not when you get it. Oh, yeah. And then I'll be doing a DFO in January, which should not be Christmas themed. <laughs> yeah. I decided to, to do it every other month just so I could save some money for the holidays. This is a good plan for me. Crazy thought. I know. <laughs> well, we hope you enjoyed the uh, first episode of Vlogmas. Mm hmm. Vlog Summer? Vlog Summer, which is what our friend Sarah has called it, even though it's Vlogmas. That's oh, okay, Sarah. Man. But we have some fun things planned. Yes, we, we do. We have do. a Justine's idea. We'll let you know what it is when it happens. 
um, coming up. Yeah. So, just remember, you guys, Vlogmas is a feeling in your heart. <laughs> bah humbug. This one. That's <laughs> not true. She's in very much in the spirit. Whitney has very beautiful Christmas trees and lots of advent calendars going on. <laughs> I do. Yeah, I, I do. Like I, and the thing an that, advent calendar. I enjoy it so much. I look forward to her opening them. It's it's like so cute to see. Everybody does. Yeah. So my collection of Pom Funko dolls is getting crazy. Growing large. We're gonna have to get you like chains to hang them from. I <laughs> <laughs> might have to come up with a new one next year. I just do a countdown every day of like how many days is to go, but people also enjoy. But it's everyone else is that too. I'm not, I'm not unique. <laughs> no, no, oh, that's fine. Whatever brings people enjoyment. That's what we're here for. So, um, thanks again for joining us. Don't forget to follow us at Raindrops T N W and hit subscribe up top. We have roughly 22 followers right now. We could use some more. So, uh, we do have that promised party coming. Yes. Tina's still thinking of an idea. I had an idea to build a snowman. Someone keeps sorting it. Someone needs to learn to drive in the snow. I don't think it's gonna happen. Well, then it ain't my fault, is it? <laughs> we could we could Uber <laughs> to the okay. snow. Yes, Ubering during a pandemic. And a snowstorm. We'll all die. It's a good idea. Together. It's a good idea. Good night. Sleep tight. Bye. Bye. Bye.